First snake of the day, look at this. Spotted by mi madre. Amy has taken the lead again with this big guy. Whoa, baga! Mr. Babito lives on. Ooh, you're a feisty one, aren't you? You're a cranky little baga. Wow, look at this. He's missing a hand. Yeah, buddy, I didn't mean to point out your flaws. You're very beautiful. Hey, buddy. How are you? You're so handsome. Ladies, gentlemen, people of all ages, it's a big day here A Duff does nature stuff. It's not Duff's ranch or Duff's farm, it's just my house. But we got mom in town. We got the big dog, Amy, in town. Now she surprised me a bit. She texted me yesterday, she said, I'm flying in tomorrow. And I said, oh, my house looks bad. Look at us. We're taking on the yard. Now a few of you have commented, and a few of my friends have also said, Hey, you have a really nice yard. If you took care of it, it'd actually be pretty cool. That's the goal today. We're doing some yard cleaning. I mean, look at this. Go, go. Golly. Custom fire pit, built it myself with a shovel. Bob's old greenhouse that no longer is functioning. Empty water monitor cage with a great money tree though. That's not the point. The point is we're doing some cleaning, then we're gonna do some snaking. We got mom in town. It's gonna be a fun day. My parents have a tough record. You know, they visit in the winter a lot. They have a tough record with these burns. This is the trip. We're gonna get mom on a python. And then we'll just see. You guys know how my videos go. I don't even know what we're gonna do in the video until we're doing it. So I'm gonna get back to cleaning before she comes over here and beats me. But we're gonna shovel up. We're gonna rake up. We're gonna clean up. And then we're going snaking. So stay tuned. And I love you. What the hell is going on, Bob? Are we tearing up your yard, dude? Look at him. He's like, this is my poop corner of the shed. This is the corner of the shed where I poop. You get out of my poop corner, boy. My bad. Dude acts like he pays fucking rent. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're back out. It's, it's tomorrow now. We cleaned up a bit. All right here, we got Mamacita with us. We're out here hiking. And you know I don't hike for the joy of hiking at all. We're out here looking for snakes, you son of a gun. I haven't seen any yet, but we've only been hiking about 10 minutes. If you see me again, if you hear from me again, guess what? We found something. See you then. Well, Mike, you dropped a f***ing marshmallow on the ground, Mike. Just kidding, guys. It's python poop. Pretty darn cool. Could be gator poop, too. But this right here. And that tunnel. Boy! Boy, if you with me? First snake of the day. Look at this. Spotted by me madre. Oh, baga! Where you going, mate? Where you off to, baggy? Come on, then. Let's go for a... Let's go for a hike. Come on, mate. Look at you. Look at you, mister. Look at that. A beautiful cotton mouth and a big one at that. A little skinny. Don't worry, buddy. You're free to go. I just got to get a good look at you for the YouTubers. A really pretty cotton mouth. We love those light-colored ones down here. Say goodbye, buddy. Enjoy your journey. It's a native species, pit viper. Mildly venomous, not a fun bite. You'll lose a finger for sure. Good luck, my friend. Hasn't been but five minutes. We got another little buddy here. Hey, hey. Ooh, you're a feisty one, aren't you? You're a cranky little bugger. Another really pretty cottonmouth, honestly. These are normally some ugly little snakes. But this guy, hey, a little more defensive. Look at him. Oh, a big tough guy. Come on, get off the red then, mate. Come on. Off with you. Oh, look at him, bugger. Oh, bugger. Oh, bugger, you're so feisty, ain't ya? Don't worry, buddy. I don't want to pet cottonmouth. And I ain't gonna eat you. Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. Two snakes in five minutes. We've been hiking about an hour. It's starting to heat up. It's pretty good. It's one to zero. Mom's beating me. That second snake, we'll call it a tie because we both saw it at the same time. Except for I saw it first. Anyway, shut up over there. Guys, don't tell your moms to shut up. They'll hit you really hard. Anyway, mm -hmm. ow. Two snakes down. Two cotton mouths. Not the target species. But it's a good indicator. Snakes are moving. Natives are moving. That's a good sign. Look what they did to my boy. They massacred him. Let's see. What kind of snake is this? Now, shout out Ant-Man's Adventures. Ow! For teaching me. Cottonmouths have a very distinct ridge in their skeleton. Very, very distinct here, mate. Check out the tall vertebrae there. 
Yeah, that's a cotton mouth if I ever seen one, mate. R.I.P. the bugger. Now, I don't know which one of you sickos is out here killing my cotton mouth friends, but I'm gonna find you. Now, it's probably a bird, but the fact that there's no head or tail on any of these, a wee bit suspicious. All right, you sickos, this one's a little too dirty for me to pick up, but we're gaining on whatever creature is doing this. Each skeleton gets a little more fresh. Uh-oh, one to one. Now, to be fair, I did take her side because it's the good side. So, uh, controversial point here for old Duff, but uh, we're gonna take it. She's trying to cheat and walk ahead of me, what the hell? Hold on, let me go catch up. Looky, looky, looky. A shed skin here now, it looks to me to be a cotton mouth. It's old skin, at least, at least a couple months old, if not older. We're on the trail, boys and girls. Amy has taken the lead again with this big guy. Whoa, bugger! Take it easy, dude. I'm tough does nature stuff. I ain't no damn poacher. Uh, look at him. You wanna know why they call him a cotton mouth? Because they used to actually own these big plantations. No, I'm just kidding. Alexander. Sorry. They, look at this display. It's a defense display. That big mouth showing off those fangs, that white mouth. Get the hell away from me, dude. Good spot by my mama. That's two points to Amy. Three points. Oh, bugger! All right, we're gonna leave him alone. He's a grumpy one. Here we have a leopard gecko. Notice he has no fear because he is a subscriber to my YouTube channel. We don't want to get too close and- Wow, look at this! He's missing a hand. Yeah, buddy, I didn't mean to point out your flaws. You're very beautiful. Hey, Alex, who found that? Anyways, my mom saw this huge giant gator sitting on the middle of nowhere. I don't know how she actually spotted it. It's a tough spot. She wanted some credit. Look at him. He's got no fear. A skinny little guy missing a hand. He's had a hell of a life. Wow, he's in rough shape, but I'm proud of you, buddy. You're fighting on. You're fighting on. This looks like a baby cooter, maybe? Yep, potentially. Mom, it's not that type of cooter, you pervert. But he got torn up. Look at them holes in the shell. That's a predator. He got predated. Lord help him. Check this out. We're on our way out now. Lots of cotton mouths found. Now these scales don't quite look like python, but these ventrals are huge. So this is either a monstrous, monstrous cotton mouth or a diamondback. Or this is from a berm. No luck so far. We got a couple miles left though. We might find one. Getting cloudy out. We don't love clouds. Ant Man says no sun, no snakes. Let's see how that goes. You guys see the snake? Can you see it? How about now? Oh, oh my god. A little neonate. A little babe. Hey buddy, how are you? You're so handsome. You still got some neon tail going. Look at you, you're so cute. We're not gonna pay attention to the shit talk. There he goes. Bye buddy. Bye buddy. Be good buddy. I saw, oh, he's a quick one. I saw this little divot. I thought maybe it might be a small python. Still a snake though, guys. You never know, you never know. We're going on a bob hunt. And don't think we don't know how to wee. Them out. You know, a lot of people think dandelions are weeds. And I've brought this up before. You shouldn't always trust what they tell you. These are magical plants. Unfortunately, well, not unfortunately, but these are for Bob, not for Pepe. I might eat some though. Mr. Bobito, Mr. Bobito. Wait, wait, dude. There you go. Mr. Babito is so delicious, man. Eh? The red dandelion. One of the most nutritious plants you can get for young Babito. Oh, Bob. What are we gonna do with you, buddy? I don't know if you guys can tell. My yard has seen better days. This half, we tried to sod. It all died. That half's all weeds. That's a fire pit. That's where Bob's house used to be. We're moving it here. We're working on that. Susan, what are you doing? But for now, it's warm, cozy. And Mr. Babito lives on. Ain't that right, Bobby? That's gonna do it though, my friends. Not the most exciting video, but they can't all be the most exciting videos. Or the exciting ones wouldn't be fun. Check that out, by the way. Got the mullet cut. I know, 
I'm not I'm not super huge on it either. Neither's Penny. But it was getting it was getting a little straggly. Oh, 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 oh. It's getting a little straggly. Had to cut it. The hair was dying. It wasn't looking good. I'm a little bummed because it's short. But we had to do it. We had to do it. You guys want to talk about some spoiled puppy dogs? Wait till you see what I feed these fat dogs. So check it. This stuff here, Fresh Pet, not not a sponsor. We start with that. And look at these two, pretending to be good dogs. Oh, <laughs> got it! <laughs> now we got the Greek yogurt in there. Let's close this up here. Look at these. Sit down. No, both of you, sit down. You're just good girls. I know you're so fat. You see there, now we've added the Cossackwin. I think that's what it's called. Joint health supplement for my old girls. Last thing here. Last but not least, one quail egg each with the shell. Give it one little bump there, crack it a bit. Pop, drop it right in. Give it a crack here. Oh! Oh, good thing we got an extra. Here. Oh, oh for two. Wow, I'm not doing great today, guys. Well, there's your egg soup. You see these dogs pretending to be good, and I watch this as soon as I pick the bowl up. All right. Let's go, Susan! Let's go, Susan! Where are we going? Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Fat girls. Fat girls. And that is a day in the life of these dogs. We go for walks, we get spoiled, we slurp down some food. Another classic example of your boy Duff filming and editing a full video and realizing I didn't do an outro. Here we are doing an outro. We've got our boy Shadow right here. We're doing what we do, folks. You're gonna see this one today. This is today, you're watching this today. This is today that I'm filming this today. So happy day. Anyways. Thank you so much for watching. It was a great visit. It was always great. It's always good to see mama. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you very soon. I love you dearly. Thank you for watching. Hey, 25 hours in the glades, it's still happening. Been cold and rainy. Trust me, the reason I'm waiting is because it's going to be better this way. Don't get impatient, trust the process. And no, I ain't gonna do your own. I promise you something, it's coming. All right, I love you. You're the greatest. Couldn't do it without you. Thanks for being you. Thanks for showing up. I'll see you next time. Peace.